The Creative Studio 7 help system is integrated into the software. There's three distinct ways to access the information. The online version has links included, which help the user navigate to the sections that they need. There are also videos incorporated. The short preview videos are designed to show a feature quickly for people who just need a refresher. The feature videos are longer because they cover every step of the quilting process for the major quilting applications. There are several different ways you can access the manual. You can either use the function key F1 or you can come up to your menu strip and press the help button and say manual. That brings up the online manual. Now there are two different ways you can do it. If you're already in this section, you can go to the index and search. Otherwise, if you're not there already, you can go to help and go straight to the index. Then you type in what you're searching for, otherwise it's in alphabetical order. But let's say I want to look up border corner. Then all I have to do is double click on it and it brings it up. The next is you can go to help and say search and then same idea you say border hit your enter key then it will show you everywhere that the word border is found in the manual you can also access the manual by hitting the help question mark on your tool strip when you press on the keyboard shortcuts it brings up a pdf file and it will help you remember what your function keys are and your keyboard shortcuts are. The next is the About section. That tells you about your software, like your version that you have, the controller number, the red key serial number. Now notice I have my stitcher disconnected, so I don't have those numbers, but your numbers will show up right there in that section. Otherwise you can read about the license agreement. There are also help options on many of the screens. Like if you come up here to draw text and go over here to the little question mark, it will tell you what to do in that section. So anytime you see a little question mark, that's a little help option for you. And that's the help system.